and bringing in Swift.org this interesting proposal. The plan is to make the last expression in a function or closure to be a return value automatically without using the return keyword. If you remember, we are having this kind of behavior, for example, for Swift UI, when we build a view, we don't need to explicitly say return this view, or just having a single expression in a function is enough to omit the return value. But I don't know you, this kind of proposal is interesting because the problem is that, okay, I could understand that maybe just one expression in a function is okay because it's the way how SwiftUI works. But having this as a rule, I mean, if I have 100 lines and then the last one is the, is the return value, but I don't have, I'm not forced to explicitly say it, maybe that will introduce several issues for new people understanding code. I don't know. That's something that concerns me a little bit. But the point here is, I would like to read your comments. What do you think about this? Do you think it's a good idea to introduce this feature in Swift? Tell me, I'm waiting for your comments. And if you want to read this proposal, I'm leaving the link in the description. Believe me, there are a lot of mixed comments about this.